super hungry for some ribs. So I've got my big green egg fired up right now and I just picked up this from the grocery store and we're gonna make some barbecue spicy Thai glazed ribs. These things are gonna be awesome, trust me. Hey, if you need help with prep instructions, go back and check out our episode four for competition ribs. All right, now it's time to start applying your rub to your ribs. We're using two different kinds. We're using some Dirty Bird by Cosmos and also some Killer Bee Chipotle, also from Cosmos. Uh, we found that we've had great success using these two during competitions and you know what? Our friends like them too, so why not give them the best? You'll see right here we're rolling the ribs up. That way we can get good coverage on the edges of the ribs. And uh, just make sure you get good coverage on the whole thing, and I'm sure they're going to turn out great. Trust me. All right, now it's time to load those ribs up. We've got our big green egg going at 225 degrees Fahrenheit right now. But, you know, it's good all the way up to about 250. You can cook them a little bit hotter if you like. But I really think that 225 to 250 is about perfect. We've also got some pecan wood in there, some pecan chunks. It's, it's giving it a really nice smoke. Now we're going to close that big green egg up and we're going to let it smoke for about an hour and a half. After an hour and a half, we're going to start basting the top side of the ribs with our basting sauce. The sauce is just made out of uh, one part sweet Thai chili sauce and one part margarine. After 30 minutes, we're going to go ahead and flip those ribs over, and now we're going to baste the bone side. They're really starting to get a nice color. And after 30 more minutes, we're going to flip those ribs over one last time, and we're going to baste that top side. Get that meat side nice and covered. Then we're going to close it up and let it cook for 30 more minutes. Now it's time to carefully pull those ribs off and wrap them in foil. Notice we're going to put the meat side down, and then we're going to slowly roll that foil up uh, lengthwise. And then we're going to roll up the edges. We're going to put those ribs back on and let them cook for an hour to an hour and a half or basically when the meat's starting to pull back from the bone. Hey the sauce is super easy just get that Thai sweet chili sauce that you see in the store and add sriracha to your liking. Now it's time to carefully place your sauced ribs back on your smoker or your big green egg, meat side up. After 10 minutes, we're gonna pull those ribs off because they're ready to eat. All right, so we just got done with the ribs. Let's give them a try. Clear my palate. Oh man, will you look at that? Absolutely perfect. Hey there, hope you enjoyed that episode. I'll tell you, these ribs are dynamite. It's a, it's a neat new twist doing spicy Thai barbecue ribs. Might be a little crazy for some people, but not too crazy for us. Hey, have you talked your friends into subscribing? If you haven't, be sure to do it today. We really appreciate it. And remember, Drink beer, mostly craft beer, but not too much. See ya.